I got some paints. Um, been trying to do some kind of watercolory stuff, and I'm not really happy with the effects of the watercolors. I like acrylic, and then I saw where Geely Balzer was um, testing out some Holbein, Holbein, however you say it, acrylic wash, and uh, I was like, "Ooh, it looks yummy!" And Gina Kim posted it on her Instagram and I couldn't take it anymore and I had to get some. I ordered these Saturday the 28th through Dick Blick. They shipped out two days later and got to my house two days after that. So like four day turnaround. Of course I did the FedEx where I paid just a couple of dollars more. I got free shipping. I paid a couple of dollars more to get the FedEx. And here's my package and I'm going to try to open it. So this is what they came in and my daughter is talking to me about Toy Story right now and so is my son. He is running around with no pants on outside. It's insane. So this is what they ended up shipping them in. Boxes that they came in. It's starting to kind of sprinkle out here a little bit. Ooh, tubi tubes. Yes, get your drink. It's just water, silly. Ooh. Ooh, happy birthday to me. Ooh, yeah, magenta. I'm glad I got that one. Pink. Magenta. 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 That's Tallulah, y'all. And Hello. here's Grayson. Say hey. Hey. <laughs> oh, he spilled water on me. The colors I got, I got a total of 27 tubes. And a couple of things I wish I'd done is gotten a more um, primary yellow, um, not yellow, orange. And I wish I'd gotten some more white. I got just a regular tube of white and I mix white with a lot to make different colors. And uh, I can just, I've been experimenting with a cheaper pack of gouache here and I use a lot of white. And I should have gotten probably two of the big tubes of white. But these colors are amazing, especially this opera. This is mine and Lula's favorite yeah. right here. Yeah, Lula likes that. It is just like a neon pink, pink color. Pink. She loves pink. That's her pink, favorite pink, color. Pink. 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 pink, pink. Second pink. favorite color is blue. Yep. And then I, I like the ice blue. Yeah, icy kind of blue. Ice blue. Yeah. Mama That's looks nice. quite orange. Okay, all right. So those are my paints, and I'm gonna do some swatches, and probably put that at the end of this video as well. Pretty paint. I'm gonna get one out with this one. You're gonna what? I'm gonna do something. Much of a voice right now because one of my daycare kids coughed in my face the other day when she was running a fever, so that's great. But anyway. These are my color swatches for the Holbein Acrylic Gouache. I thought I had 27, but I had 26 of these. And I've gotten to play around with them a little bit. Um, this is one of the pages that I did with it. This page. I really like the colors a lot. I also did this piece. And this one I just finished today. So I really am quite fond of these paints so far. Um, they are the perfect paints. They're like a good hybrid of acrylic and watercolor and gouache. Um, they won't crackle on your palette like gouache does. You can see you can reactivate just, not really reactivate, but some color will come off if you re-wet them aggressively. See, that's been re-wet pretty aggressively. And I barely got color off of it. They mix really well with water like watercolors
It works really well for masking fluid. And then you can also just use them straight out of the tube like you would an acrylic. And get a nice opaque color. You can see here on this little sample I've used them almost like watercolor paints. And then I drew a pencil on top. In the background of this I used it like watercolor. And then these words in the foreground I've used very much like I would acrylic paints. They also have a really velvety matte finish that you can't really quite see in this picture. It's got a really good feel to it. I definitely buy these again. I will buy more. I'm looking forward to um, buying more soon. They're about $5 a bottle, but if you can get them 25% off and buy in bulk, then you can save a good deal. I bought all 25, 26 of these for I think $111 with shipping included. So once again, these are the Holbein Acryla gouache paints. And uh, they're different than regular gouache paints because instead of being bound with gum arabic, they're bound with an acrylic polymer binder. So they dry very much like acrylics would and are not easily reactivated. I've never spent this much money on paints before, so I'm being really frugal with them. And I'm not wasting very much at all. I did a little bit last night. I forgot to do this right there. It dried up. And this won't reactivate like typical gouache. So here's the places where I've cleaned it. So what I do is I just get my extra. And I paint it onto a scrap paper. Build up layers. And I'll do something with this later on. Okay, sorry about my awful voice today, but... My children are actually with my husband today, so the house is quiet. I can do this without kids, so I decided to go ahead, crazy voice and all, record the rest of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.